Let's talk politics for a okay. minute. You said that Senator Cruz appeared to be kind of copying your immigration plan. Your plan, as I understand it, is deportations, and then you'll let the good ones back in once they've left the country. His yeah, plan... Yeah, well, they have to go through a process. They go through a process. His plan is just deportations. Okay. So is he stricter on undocumented? No. Well, first of all, his plan just happened, okay? In fact, I was watching the other day, and I was watching Ted talk, and he said, we will build a wall. The first time I've ever heard him say it. And my wife, who was sitting next to me, said, oh, look, he's copying what you've been saying for a long period of time. No, no. I'm talking about deportation, and people can come back into the country, not just that group, but other people can come back, but everybody has to come into our country legally, and I want a strong border. And I'm the one that came up with it. Look, when I announced that I was running, I brought up illegal immigration. It wasn't even a subject that would have been discussed in this debate, and now it's one of the very big subjects. Ted Cruz is trying to step up his whole game on amnesty and on illegal immigration, because it was actually quite weak, and you listen to him and Marco Rubio, they're trying to, you know, solve the problems that they've had in the past, because they were both weak on it, and I have been very strong on it, so they're trying to get stronger on it. But look, nobody has that position like I have that position. I want the wall, I want strong borders, I want everybody out. Now people are coming to me, but nobody has that issue like me. And nobody's going to be able to do it like me. Nobody has an example on the wall. Nobody is getting Mexico to pay for the wall, the cost of the wall, but me. They don't even know about that. It's not even in their vocabulary. But nobody thinks you're going to get Mexico oh, to pay for the wall. You know why? They make a fortune with us. So much more money than what you're talking about. They're making a fortune. We have trade deficits. We have... If you look at the kind of numbers that Mexico makes with us, the wall is peanuts. Only a business person would say that. The politicians don't understand it. They're all talk and no action. Wouldn't You said that the good ones would come back on an, on an expedited basis. Wouldn't Senator Cruz say, well, that's amnesty? I think that the good ones will be coming back, and I would say that we want to have them back, but we want to have a lot of other people. You know, we have one problem. We have millions of people waiting on a list that have gone through a legal process and they can't get into the country. We have to take care of them. I want people to come in. They just have to come back legally. When you say uh, uh, about Senator Cruz, not too many evangelicals come out of Cuba. What does that mean? Well, it just means that Cuba, generally speaking, is a Catholic country, and you don't equate uh, evangelicals with Cuba. I don't. I mean, I think of evangelicals, and I have a, I guess I am, you know, I'm Presbyterian, I'm Protestant, but I don't see it as coming out of Cuba. But you're not questioning whether, I mean, as far as you know, he could be more devout than you are. I, it's possible, certainly it's possible. I'm not questioning, and I say it in a somewhat smiling manner, uh, but there's a little truth to it. <laughs>